Hello everyone. Uh, today I wanted to uh, do a video, make a video about uh, about talking about this company called Transferwise. Um, uh, really explaining to you guys how it works. So pretty much, I've been using uh, Payoneer this whole time, and I just want to talk about the advantages and disadvantages of Transferwise. So pretty much, Transferwise is a company that uh, its main focus is on on a currency exchange so if you want to change your uh euros for pounds pounds for dollars whatever any currency they support a lot of currencies um really all, all the major ones are there if you're looking for it you can go to transferwise.com and then search for the currency you want to transfer and they will tell you like an estimate of the fees now the good thing about transferwise and and this feature of of currency conversion is that they will just tell you exactly how much they'll they charge you and then they give they give you the the exchange rate, uh, that the market exchange rate. So you know that what they char they're charging you is exactly what they're saying. Because for example, in in MoneyGram or these other companies, they tell you, okay, we charge a lower fee, right? Just like a dollar, but they give you a super super terrible exchange rate. So at the end, you receive less money than if you would have sent it through here. So actually you save a lot of money doing that and they uh, they support a lot of currencies like i said before you can uh transfer from your bank account from credit or debit cards ach uh pushes or pulls i don't, I don't really know um apple pay or whatever so they're really great however i want to talk about an instrument that they have a product that they offer to their clients which is called the borderless account now this account gives you like a uh, bank account details they're not a bank however they have partner with banks all around the globe so they're able to give you certain bank account details where you can give those to your family friends companies whoever you want and they can go ahead and transfer or pay you to that account and you will have that money uh, to your name over there now you can also have with them this uh transfer ways transfer wise uh debit card which is the one you're seeing right now on screen which is green is a master card prepaid or a debit if you want to call it and uh like the name says you need to have balances in this card for it to be able to work it's not credit so all the uh the balances that are loaded into this account you're going to be able to either spend it at no charge if you are spending that currency that you have loaded or if let's say for example you have euros loaded and you're traveling to the us and you're spending dollars then it will uh, exchange the euros for us dollars at the like a lower uh, like a low fee of about 0.5 percent to two percent each time so it's really nice and uh it's contactless it's uh it's really good service and um now compared to pioneer i believe transfer wise is actually better because for example in trans in, in pioneer i'm sorry uh whenever you get paid um this only applies for the the united states uh account uh whenever you pay whenever you get paid in usd and us dollars you get charged a one percent fee just for receiving that money and uh, for example, that the the debit card that Payoneer offers, you need one one debit card or prepaid card for each and every single one of the accounts. So you have a prepaid for the euro, one prepaid for the USD, one prepaid for whatever. So it's really a hassle having to manage all those cards and all of these uh, accounts. And uh, I've been I've used both, and I can tell you that it's transfer wise so much easier and user friendly user friendly i'm sorry and uh also uh withdrawals for example if you have um uh, your uh, your euros in in your account uh you there's no need for you to uh convert it for example into another currency you just want to withdraw it to a european bank account um you can do it uh, there are different types that you can do on transfer wise uh, so the, the the cheapest one is going to be like 63 cents <clears throat> for you to get that money now for example i used to get paid in pioneer and uh whenever i try to transfer that money internationally to another bank that was not in the u.s however it was in u.s dollar uh currency using the swift um protocol 
uh, they charged me fifteen dollars per transfer, and in transfer wise, I get paid like I- I'm sorry, I-, I get charged like four dollars. So I'm saving up a bunch over there. Uh, not talking about the one percent that I'm also saving every time I get paid. And in Payoneer, you cannot get paid by uh, normal people, regular people. You can only get paid on your accounts um, if a payment comes from a uh, from a major. Uh, business like Amazon, Airbnb, whatever you can do that. However, in in transfer wise, you can receive money from any of those, and also uh, people or uh, anyone you like. So it's a uh, it's pretty neat service they're offering. Now, um, if you want to sign up and uh, exchange your currencies, if you're looking for that, I will be leaving a link in the description below. If you sign up with that link, you're going to be able to transact and convert up to 500 euros or equivalent currency in the in your your currency. You're going to be able to transact or convert 500 euros to your currency or any currency you like for free. So you're not going to pay any fee and you're going to get the market exchange rate on the first one. Uh, please note that if you're going to transfer with a debit card or credit card, there is going to be an extra fee added because of the uh, payment processing that uh, Visa and MasterCard or even American Express uh, charge. That is, it's unavoidable. So, thank you guys for watching. I hope uh, this review was helpful of use. And uh, till the next one.